off does the street. Does really take pictures of clients' feet? Is Bernie really a Jedi? Is yeah. Alex really a bear? What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to Vision Paradox reacts to viral ads. Today we are doing uh, kind of a miniature version of the. Well, today we're reacting to Super Bowl ads. We're not reacting to all of them, just the ones that we were kind of interested in. So if you guys want us to react to more Super Bowl ads or any other ads, or even Facebook ads, whatever it is, comment down below. Yeah. So a little, if it's your first time here and you don't know who we are, uh, I'm going to do a quick intro of everyone because it's going to take another 20 minutes for all of us to talk. I'm Emory, the CEO of Vision Paradox uh, and uh, runs everything. But uh, Maxine is the real CEO, a social media marketer, copywriter, uh, fashion extraordinaire, and, <laughs> and also my co-host at the Alcourt Tea Party. So um, next up is the villain in the room, B-Rock. He's a photographer. He takes photos of our clients, does headshots, and sometimes he does follows them home and takes photos of them in their bedroom. So mm -hmm. next oh, the feet. Is, <laughs> of their feet. Uh, <laughs> next up is the judo master, but she's actually a Jedi master. You didn't know that oh, in yeah. the previous one, but now, yeah, she's a judo Jedi master. <laughs> so Bernie is social media marketer, <laughs> it helps with the ads, also with the copywriting and the SEO. And last but not least is the Russian bear who got lost. Russian in Florida, extraordinaire. Ru Russian, <laughs> Russian extraordinaire, the video <laughs> editor and uh, current digital nomad in this team who's traveling mm -hmm. the world. Yes. Right now he's in Florida. Next he's going to be going to the Bahamas. Alex of the world. And then uh, Japan. To the Mars. And then to Mars. the Mars. Mars. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Bruno Mars. So that is the team. My shortened version of it. Uh, you guys figure out which is the truth and which is a lie. The truth <laughs> is a lie. I'm just here. I don't work so, here. Well, Do you really <laughs> so them up does off the does Rock really take pictures of clients' feet? Is Bernie a, really a Jedi? Is yes. Alex really a bear? Is he is actually Florida? Really a CEO? <laughs> am I really the yes, CEO? The same, the same thing. Or am I? So, Bernie, can uh, you first choke me for the first? <laughs> <laughs> Insert corpse husband here. Insert corpse. Yeah, choke I've got me. Me. <laughs> Choke me like you love oh, God. me. Oh, that, hate me. That's a great song. I kind of want to choreograph to that one. Dude, I'm a big fan of oh, corpse husband. Yeah, shout out to corpse husband. He's a great he got uh, He got himself a billboard on Times Square. Dude, it's he, he blew up with just, oh my God. With, with Amogus. Yeah, dude, among us yeah we yeah, should do uh we should do a zero two video it's a zero two video just look it up and then you'll see what i'm talking about okay it's a tiktok thing okay uh all right so like yeah, i said next. we're gonna be reacting to some super bowl ads the first one we're gonna do is the neighborhood doordash big game commercial this is featuring uh sesame street and david diggs from hamilton Ooh, hamilton so let's get right into it. Mr. Lafayette. Yeah, physical, physical. I thought he was smoking for a second. <laughs> I was like, yo. <laughs> Eating takeout. God, that's creepy. The neighborhood. Hey, let's go. I missed him. Okay. Kabachi. Hey. Hey. MRI. Empanada. <laughs> what he said. to corner stores doordash i'm all right and for every order we'll donate one dollar to sesame workshop hey uh, oh that's that was what cool. i like i mean Se i think sesame street is forever going to be an amazing <laughs> brand mm, for sure the uh, beat is fire yeah I, <laughs> <laughs> I can't unsee what you post on facebook about the different big birds so oh yeah like, the cousin yeah that's true. The cousin. More of you. Yeah. So, uh, the creative dope. The beat is yes. sick. Oh, Sesame yeah. Street always gonna be dope. David yeah. Diggs. I love how Sesame Street oh. is always like, is somehow playing with like the relevance, but it's also because they made an influence on these artists and it's kind of 
like one of the last few wholesome things that are existing oh, yes. that yeah, has had definitely. a lot a that long, people could relate to yeah which is pretty awesome and they um, i like how they show diversity too with the food yeah they had hibachi oh, yeah. they had empanadas they're not just burger they weren't just showing burgers and, and fries Chinese takeout <laughs> or whatever yeah they showed how doordash offers a variety of different cuisines yeah like Which i like also the, depends on the neighborhood yeah yeah <laughs> the, the neighbor. I, I love how they my brought... neighborhood if i doordash anything it's just diner food <laughs> it, it kind of makes me want to go vegan because of like this cute chicken and like he's just a bird it's, it, 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 it's so cute <laughs> and like you understand that you will eat that <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Yeah, I grew up by a farm. I but love, I suddenly love. wonder, would it have the same effect to like the younger generation as it has with us? I mean, Ooh. Right? I mean, Sesame Street I mean, is still a, a thing with the, with the younger generation and the little kids. I feel like because, yeah, because like parents, they're on YouTube now. Might the kids, mm-hmm. they might as well show it to YouTube because I remember I was showing some of it to, to Jordan when he was young and he was obsessed with El- Elmo for a while. Elmo. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, so Elmo. It's always likes Elmo. Elmo. It's always Elmo. Elmo. It's yeah. like a brand that transcended generations because it <laughs> adapted to the time. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because that's what I love about the Sesame Street brand because they can adapt but also mm-hmm. like still stay centered with their message and who they are. Yeah, and the yes. fact that they're that DoorDash yes, exactly. is working with them too, man. So I think yeah. with this one, they utilize Sesame Street, obviously marketing towards adults that can pay for yes. their own food. Or yeah. that could, um, yeah, with, I was supposed to say the same thing. They're using it. The um, they were using the nostalgia, nostalgia factor. Nostalgia, yeah. Because yeah. this, like, yeah, oh, you're right. This was the neighborhood. This was like uh, obviously aired on Super Bowl ads, which is I think the the only traditional the big media game spend. Not to say oh. Super Bowl. Yeah. So, what really? Yeah. Okay. It's so branded, no one says it. Like seriously, if anyone, that's why it says big game commercial. Fair. Okay. The Super Bowl <laughs> is a trademarked brand. Yeah. So, uh, okay. <laughs> I like how he drank soda in that. Not Coca Cola. <laughs> <laughs> so, like as I was saying, like the big game commercial or Super Bowl ads, really, like is the, the only tradition. The the superb L. It's the only traditional media spend that I think makes sense in the states because people are actually watching it. The Super Bowl ads in itself has its own brand because it's always coming out with some weird shit. It's almost like people watching the previews before a movie. Like people don't want to miss the previews. Like people for this, like they want to see the Super Bowl ads because it might be some crazy shit. So like the other one we said, like the other non-existent ads we watch, like the Tide commercial one. So. Oh, yeah. We're in a tight ad. That was a genius. <laughs> God. It's a tight oh, I ad. I forgot about that. Is this is a tight ad. Back. The, Mr. <laughs> the Mr. Clean tight ad. Look yeah. at Alex wearing white. What? Tight what? ad. I know he's tight a tight ad. ad. We're in a tight ad, guys. What? What? I would. Oh, would I buy it? <laughs> um, I would not. Use would you DoorDash? Door I honestly really? prefer Uber Eats. Oh. I use DoorDash more than Uber Eats or Postmates, actually. I so everyone watching this cheaper. on YouTube, we have a photographer over. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I do DoorDash to order for my partner, like little surprise food. Uh, that's what I do for Emory. I know. Oh yeah, but it's not a surprise because I'm just like it's gonna be knocking on your door, so I'm not <laughs> responsible for that. <laughs> Here's that's the link. Crack your order. <laughs> pretty much, but branding was great. Creative was great. It, had, it has. It also had the star fire. power. David David Diggs. Fire. David Diggs is great. <laughs> I'm great. Oh, yeah. Because simply because I love Hamilton, so no, oh, bro, I love Hamilton. I could. I they should watch it live. Shut I up. want to, okay. I know. But you know, no, no. Company trip Mike. to temper ta- to temper ta- to Hamilton. <laughs> Company trip to New York. Dude, I'd be down. I'd be so down. <laughs> Don't bullshit me. Don't bullshit me. I would. Y'all better keep up with me though. Okay. Oh my God, Max walks. I I walk out of it, California. It all fits greatly in New York. I mean the the only the only one that can the only one that can fuck with me is Alex. (laughs) Yeah, because Alex is the tallest one of all. Only only Alex can keep up with these long strides. Meanwhile, I'm just like, yeah. (laughs) And Alex is just like gonna slowly stride into it. I know. Just like, where are we going? I'm like, oh shit, uh, over there. (laughs) Yeah. My camera froze. So you guys should just follow Alex while he's. Yeah, because I'm gonna get distracted if I have my camera with me. Ooh, nice picture. There you go. Where the fuck oh. is everybody? Yeah, yeah, no, don't do that with Max. Oh. Please don't. I learned that. I learned that the hard way. I will leave. I always, even to this day, when we're out, 
and where I'm vlogging, I'm talking, I'm like, <laughs> who'd she go? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, we need to get there. We have reservations. Let's so, go. All right. So I mean, okay, yeah, there's, there's reservations. I'll be speedy, but if it was just like, you know, gallivanting, yeah, being tourists, Gallivant like I really thing. would be gallivanting. You know what I mean? We're just chilling. I'll, I'll meet you at a bar while you guys do that. I know. You, <laughs> you just tell her. Just, just I'll, I'll see you there. I'll give you an address. Just like, Righto. Let's go. Yeah. All right. You guys ready for the next, this next one? I'm. In- let's go. Yeah. Oh, this one. Amazon's big game commercial. I don't want it to go big game. Okay. Because it's it a big, big game. It's not big to me. That's what <laughs> she said. <laughs> okay. Next. <laughs>